Good afternoon everyone. Good afternoon, welcome back to the channel. Today I'm in Brent Cross Shopping Centre. Uh, this is the borough of Barnet in the UK. It's a really quite a big shopping centre actually and uh, plenty of shops. Um, it's quite old, very old shopping centre. It opened in uh, 1976 and uh, it's got plenty of shops, loads of restaurants, lots of places to relax and enjoy. So just on the trip here today guys, so let's go on a nice walk. Uh, I think there's about uh, two floors. So I think I'm going to stay on the ground floor and then definitely work my way up. It's a nice day today guys, it is meant to rain later, but for now it's uh, roughly 21 degrees, sun is out. For now, it's a beautiful Wednesday, guys. I think there's going to be lots of uh, popular shops and well-known shops in here. But then I think it's kind of uh, nice to see a few unique places as well boutique shops you know not just your normal shops on the high street this is the well-known John Lewis guys let's go and have a look in here and see what we can see it's a very nice shop I must say Some nice smelly stuff here. Oh, it smells amazing over here. Absolutely amazing. Mm -hmm. Let me just smell this one. Mm. What's this one here? Wow, oh, smells lovely. All different types here, as you can see. Interesting stuff, isn't it? Christmas, birthdays. Very nice indeed. Something that you can keep, somebody that everything, everyone would like, but you just have to know what scent they would like, depending on the person, I guess. So, have to take your guess and hope for the best. Guys, check out these flowers. Like, how real do they look? Amazing, look at these. Oh, these are beautiful. Real. Some of them look so tacky sometimes, don't they? Depending on where you get them from, they look so cheap. But these can definitely pass as being real. Wow, look at this.
guys look what I've just found how sweet is this mm, two little cats 52 pounds some other little bits here This is so cute guys, look at this one down here. Mm. Hello doggy. 90 pounds, okay then. Wow, this is just like the picture section guys. You can just see here. I think this one up here guys. London Bridge. How cute are these lampshades? They look so smooth. <laughs> they remind me of snowballs actually. Beautiful. So going back downstairs guys. I'm sure everyone knows the body shop the products are really nice So they're very reasonably priced and they've got so many different kinds of products for different different parts of the body you know here you're able to try a different variety of different flavored creams which makes it really nice I tried some the other day as well and it was so lovely so moisturizing for the skin and look guys, it's 96 hour hours of nourishing, nourishing moisture. Come on, you can't beat that. I think they're like 19.99, 20 pounds, but it's definitely worth it. Go on and see what else there is. This place actually got its name from uh, the road outside because it kind of crosses over. It's like a main sort of motorway outside. So that's where this building here, this shopping mall, got its name from. And they decided to just stick the name and call it Brent Cross. So, yeah, that's where the name came from, guys. So it's literally 20, 27 years old. It's quite a good few years now. Twenty-seven, guys. I'm half asleep. Forty-seven. Twenty-seven is nothing. <laughs> So 47 years old, amazing. Guys, check out the chandeliers. Oh, wow. Wow, 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 wow.
ladies getting their beauty products done. was the first largest enclosed shopping centre built in the UK. Wow, I didn't know that. And there was obviously competition and it set the standard guys for other malls to open up and uh, this mall actually stays open until 8 o'clock in the evening. And I'm not sure if it's every day or just on a Thursday. But some stores in the UK, they do stay open uh, late, at least one day of the week. We're going now upstairs using the escalator to the food court. Obviously, they've got your standard Nando's, which is pretty standard to me, if you ask me. Pizzeria. This reminds me of uh, when I was in Canary Wharf. It definitely looks like Canary Wharf up here. More or less the same... Uh, food places as well. Check out that previous vlog guys. Oh we've got a Shake Shack. I know that's another food place that is uh, very popular and there's quite a lot of them actually. Fet Okay so not that many guys but obviously a few. Let's go back downstairs. Hi guys, I've just come into H&M home. Just want to be a little bit nosy really. I know they usually have some really nice stuff in here. And they've got a sale, they've got a sale. Definitely come to the sale section first, 100%. Dark leather. I'm gonna smell this. Hold on guys, let me just see if I can touch you there. Oh. Nice. Why would I even smell that? Dark leather, who wants to smell like dark leather? <laughs> okay, this is not the cell section, but I'm loving. Let me see if I can, can you see the sparkle on the edges? Oh, beautiful, let's see these. It's amazing. Okay. Nine ninety nine. What a bargain. Oh look and they've got the small ones as well. 
Oh my gosh, these are so cute. These are so adorable. Oh wow, these are so nice. Can you just see the detail, guys? Let me just zoom in so you can see. Can you see the detail around the edges? I can't see any cups though. They've got the side plates as well, but I'm not seeing any cups around here. My mum was talking about a cake stand the other day. So she may have to come in here to visit. Not really feeling these guys. I've got these. These are a bit too pretty for my liking. They are unusual. If that's your cup of tea, then yeah. That's quite sweet. Wow. Amazing. I love these. It's like a kind of Aztec kind of print, isn't it? And what is the price of these? Let's have a look, guys. Hold on. I don't know if it's coming out well in the shop, but that is, uh, again, guys, $9.99. Okay, not bad at all. I don't actually need any of this stuff, guys. I'm just being nosy, but I must say, I am tempted. Oh, they've got the mug as well. Quite a small mug, though. I do prefer a bit of a a bigger mug to be honest i'm not one but i do prefer a big one that's a nice green as well isn't it beautiful the soft toys is that kermit or just a random frog i'm not too sure but these are so nice oh look and it's oh, beautiful and soft oh hello gorgeous hello <laughs> don't mind me guys a bit on the crazy side i think this is like a door stopper right well, maybe not but you can use it as one well. A door stopper and to stop the draft coming through. What else do we have here? Oh, we've got a free wheelie. Well, oh, this is nice. Oh, a little draft. Some really cute stuff for kids. Let's have a look at the prices, guys. Let's have a look at the price of this. Let's see. It's H&M. H&M is not, you know, too expensive. Very reasonable in price. It's like $14.99. So that's nice. And then just see what I can see. Oh, what is this? Oh, look at this. Oh, this is like a little towel, isn't it? With like a hood on it, right? This is really nice. Kids love this kind of stuff, don't they? It just makes it kind of fun while they're coming out of the bath and stuff, you know. This one's got this pattern going down here. Got some kind of dinosaur. Okay, I'm scaring myself now. Let me just put that down. <laughs> Just smell this guys, this is smelling amazing. So if you ever come to H&M home, let's try and see if I can get the name up for you. Definitely check this out guys, this smells amazing. Can't even see the name myself, Yuzu Blossom. It smells lovely. So I'm in this shop guys and there's some really cute little things in here for the little kiddies like little small little sweet little look at this it's just so unusual it's a doll's pendant like how cute are these wow look at these randomly they've got utensils in here guys <laughs> oh, okay very random indeed but I'm loving those look at these three pounds look at that I'm absolutely loving these three pounds yes wow and look at these look oh these are adorable I'm so tempted to buy one should I really treat myself I'm loving it or should I just come back and try and purchase the whole set I don't know they've got these ones but I'm not too keen on these ones I think these ones are definitely more unusual so they are food grade 304 stainless steel wow 
excellent polish finish for a high quality life mm, okay coming down to these ones here and then you've got green Guys, look at this. How sweet is this? All you need to do is just press that button there. That flips up. And then there you go. You just drink from that. And it's actually got a strap as well in there. So you can attach the strap, I suppose, and just kind of... I think this bit here... Oh, look, that bit there. Okay, that bit there goes up. And that locks it. Okay. And then that... Yeah, it goes down and you press that. Okay, that's that's quite cool. Very nice. I've got another colour as well. I suppose that one's possibly for the boys and then this one is for the girls. This is like a peachy kind of pinkish kind of colour. So that's really nice again. Oh this is my oh this one's lovely. I'm loving this one. That's really nice. Different colours of the rainbow. Give it like a quite a nice crystal effect. Feeling that I can't see any prices though. Oh, the prices are here. Okay, so that one there is nine pounds, the little piggy one, and this one's also nine pounds. Okay, that's nice, not bad at all. and see if I can actually get into the fairground which is just over there so I'm not allowed in guys what a shame but anyway it looks good from what I can see um how much is it again love for 50 four pounds okay so it's four pounds to get in guys and uh, I can see some sand from here um, there is lots of rides um, yeah it looks it looks nice you can see that I'll give you a little even though I might get into trouble because she said no filming she said I can do it on my phone but not my camera um, but uh, yeah. yeah let's see what's around this corner shall we oh look at that I'm being very naughty I'm being very naughty but yeah so you get the gist guys there's a massive ride over there and there's a carousel which I absolutely love Anyway, I better go. I would never, ever go on that. But anyway, oh, and there's a massive inflatable there. Oh, and then guys, oh, and there's obviously a palm tree, which anyone who knows me knows, knows, knows I love palm trees. It's not real though, guys. Let's not get it twisted. But anyway, we tried, we tried. All right, guys, so yeah. And this is where I would say thank you once again, guys, for coming back to the channel and, uh, it's over and out for me today on this um, very now cloudy Wednesday afternoon. Uh, yeah, it's going to rain. They did predict rain for this afternoon. Uh, I just felt a drop actually on my head as I've just said that. So, yes guys, thank you so much for watching. And don't forget to like, share and subscribe. From Brent Cross guys, ciao.